Hello and welcome to this video. We're going to look at batteries. Now as I said we're going to look at batteries for a Canon 1100D. Although any other camera would be the same thing that you would look at. Right, this is a standard Canon battery. The LPE10 and it's £15 for one battery which fits the Canon range. This battery's capacity is only 860 milliamps and if you buy a ca the camera it's likely to come with a battery which only has 860 milliamps. This doesn't actually last very long so when you get a camera, even if it comes with a battery and a charger, you still need to buy a, a few more batteries to allow for your running time and maybe the battery might die. So this option gives you a USB charger with two batteries. And that's only £9. The batteries are 12 hundreds so 50% more power almost over the 860s it's always a good idea to not just rely on one battery or one SD card for your camera there's always a time when you forget or just don't have time to charge up the battery or clear off a memory card so you can take it back out and especially at these prices what's the point a USB charger takes up less space and it is very light. It, it's also like non-existent in weight. You don't really know you've got it. And it means you can charge it up anywhere. If you get a power pack, you can also just use that to plug in and charge it up even when you're sitting in the car. The three pin plug version of the charger takes up a lot more space so therefore it's a lot more weight to carry. When we move on this power charger USB has an indicator so you can see your battery's charging you can see how empty it was when it started and it charges up although this battery is only 780 this make produces a lot more higher capacity like the 1200s and any of those batteries anyway will charge up using this charger even your Canon battery now that charger in two batteries is 12 pound now I found when looking for these batteries that sometimes Amazon are better for them these are really the highest milliamps I could find for a battery to put in a Canon 2300 mega amps which means they're gonna last approximately three times longer than the original battery that came with your Canon or twice as long as the 1200s just about now I think these batteries are perfectly good for using if you're going to use your camera in movie mode because that extra power that they've got inside them will help you run longer so you don't have to change the battery so often even though even in movie mode the battery does last quite a while but these two high powered batteries and the charger are only £18 on Amazon on Prime so they are really cheap when you look at how what you're getting now someone might come up with the option that you get a one of these a grip you put it under in the battery compartment of, of it by this bit here you take the battery out you take the door off you insert it up 
you use the screw to tighten it into the bottom of the camera and then you put open the door and you put two batteries in thing comes with that is that on the 1100D and on maybe some of the other ones you also put the ST card in the same slot where the battery goes you open the door and the battery goes on one side and the card goes on the other which means to change the card inside the camera you have to unscrew the battery compartment now this for me is the real bad point of getting the grips if you have to unscrew every time you want to change your SD card you are wasting a lot of time and especially if you're at an event and recording you could miss a good bit of the action having to unscrew this off to take your memory card out put your new one in screw it back on turn back your camera back on that is not a fast job it is much quicker to use a higher capacity battery in the first place which probably will last depending on how long your event is or at least it is much quicker and easier to change so I would say that a high capacity battery even if you're going to use it just for photography is still probably a very good option now I actually only came across these a few days ago and I've actually I ordered a set so therefore I have plenty of the smaller ones the 1200s now we've got the 23 so when it comes to movies I have plenty of batteries to deal with it and you should think the same way once again a cheap option for something to get for your camera that you're going to need and you will use so in that way saving you money so we're going to keep it simple please like comment and subscribe to my channel and I'll see you on the next video